Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how I install the Barrow Mirrors on the 2022 MT10. I bought these Barrow Mirrors from AliExpress. It only took one week and then now let's unbox it. It comes in a nice packaging. These are the mirrors. I know some of you will be asking, I used to have a Barrow Mirrors, how come you bought this? So what happened was the frame that mirrors goes on started rubbing off here and then I painted it and um, and they had a couple of issues so the mirrors were too small, I uh, couldn't see the traffic properly so I ended up buying the whole set. This also comes with a Barrow. Uh, on a 2022 MT10, the Baron is actually a twist, and as well as it comes with the mirror block off bolts. This is a um, different size spacers for the frame for both sides, and then the bolts. In here, oh, it comes with Allen key as well, so you don't need to use your own. But, anyways, the boat goes in here into the mirror. Okay, let's install it. Tools you'll need are 17 millimeter wrench, 8 millimeter, and 5 millimeter socket hex, um, 3 8 inch wrench or you can just use a um, hex keys, eight millimeter and five millimeter hex. Okay, here I am on the right side of the bike. What you need to do is un unscrew this using an eight millimeter socket or hex key and 17 millimeter wrench. But this one is anti, this one is opposite thread. So you have to do um, clockwise. So that way to unscrew it. And this is the right side of the bike. After you unscrew it, the master cylinder bracket, you just put it on side because you need to get a mirror block of bolt. Okay, so what you do is you put a spacer ring in and then um, put a bar and directly and then screw it on. Don't worry about the mirror until the last step. And this is actually using six millimeter hex key. And you position it. And this is five millimeter. Okay, before you tighten it, you just um, finger tight it so you can still adjust it because that will be the final step, which is basically adjusting the mirror bracket in position and tightening this bolt. 
Okay, now we're gonna do the left side of the bike. Same thing, this is eight millimeter. I already loosened it. And this is the 17 millimeter. This is anti-clockwise to undo it. Both of the bar ends on left and right sides are all um, anti-clockwise to undo and clockwise. So it's a normal direction. Okay, so as I was trying to explain before, this is a spacer that came with it, and then this is the bar end. What you do is you put a spacer in, and there's a little um, cut, and you just expand that so it goes in all the way to the end. And then you put a frame in. I think you need to undo the screw a little bit. To the end, then it goes in properly. Okay, now screw it in. Six millimeter and then tighten the bolt. Decided to go um, with a mirror upright and the smaller end outwards. Some people have it like this, underneath like this. Some people have it in, but I prefer it this way. So what you do is, um, if you unpack it, you get a crush washer and then bolt and then um, you get the bolt, crush washer first. To the bolt that'll keep the tension without with the so that the mirror won't unscrew.
do that for both sides. And the final step is um, tightening this bolt once you set on the bike. And then make sure it's in the field of vision, the mirror, and how you like it. And then tighten this bolt. Step is um, the included mirror block of bolt. We'll put it into the mirror block. So this is the normal direction on the left side of the bike. If you want, you can put some Loctite on it. I'm not gonna bother. And then um, on the left side. On the right side, make sure the master cylinder, don't forget that, make sure you want. And then this is anti clockwise to tighten because it's the opposite direction. Oh. Oh yeah, the bar mirror is installed. I think it looks so much nicer than the previous bar mirrors I had. Just love the shape of it. It's quite aggressive. It's not too retro, contemporary design. It's nice. Oh, and also it's quite magnifying, so it makes things closer than they appear to be. So just be aware of that. The previous one are probably about 50% the size of this. This is so much better. It's not as big as a stock. Just stock and it's not as big as a stock one, but it's pretty nice. I think this will be much better than the previous bar and mirrors I had. The previous one I couldn't see properly behind like cars in the blind spot but yeah i will do another video thanks for watching and if you liked the video and if it helped you out please like and subscribe i'll put a bar and mirror link in down in the description and um, please like and subscribe my video so that i'll be motivated to do more videos in the future thank you